Hey Gemini's, I'm back y'all with another monthly video for you guys. Alright, so before we get started, I'm going to Sage. I've already Sage the cards and we are ready. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Happy that you're here. Alright, so Let's get into it. We're going to start off. We're going to use the Island Time Wellness cards. Then we'll jump into the tarot. Give me a message for Gemini's, please. Oh, right, that's like a million cards that came out. <laughs> Give me a message for Gemini's, please. We got the butterfly and I like you and camera okay Gemini's it looks like you're welcoming in someone new you're welcoming in new love okay you have new love interest a new lover it looks like you and this person are going through like a new phase. You're learning each other. Okay, I like this. Okay, you've been being more social. Your relationship is evolving to the next phase. I feel like you've healed from a situation. Um, and you have learned a lot of lessons from something in your past. Okay, so this has caused you some type of growth, some inner growth. Um, but you have someone here who, who likes you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming. Fun flirting want to wanting to date. And then we got camera. Reminiscing keepsake perception. Learning from the past and making memories. I see you and this person out. Taking pictures. Posting pictures online. Snapchat. Facebook. Instagram. Um, yeah, like I just get overall. A lot of y'all are evolving um whether this be if you're single and i feel like if it's if you are single i feel like the opportunity for you to find new love is here okay be a social butterfly get out there and you know put your best foot forward where put on something cute something nice um show interest you know if it's online just put yourself out you know just put yourself out take some cute little pictures makeup you know hair flawless nails feet done okay that type of energy because once you take that step forward it looks like you're gonna have some admirers coming in okay and this is just coming from off you posting pictures okay so that's good gemini that is good that is great 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 news all right so we're gonna hop into the tarot and let's see what's going on with this new love. I'm going to use, I think I'm going to start off with the romance. I'm going to go in with the romance angels before I jump into the tarot. Right, so yeah, I see some flirting going on. <laughs> I see a lot of flirting going on. Somebody could be flirting with you. You could be flirting with them. All right, you're feeling like, is it safe for me to let my guard down yet? Okay, 
um, a lot of y'all are trying to open up to the thought of allowing somebody else in. And see, we got to keep an open mind and express your love and attraction. You're very, very attractive. Or someone is looking at you and admiring you and feeling like you're very attractive. Um, it just it's, it's really of a question of are you open to it, okay? Are you, is your, is your mind open to being expressive to someone, to explaining to someone or how you feel or your thoughts or are you open to love? Are you open to new love? Yeah, see healing family issues and see, look at this, new love. And then the thing about it is when this new love come in, that passion going to be baby off the charts. Okay. All you got to do is make the effort. Okay, and some of y'all need to like take some time out, go out with friends because you're gonna find somebody that's gonna be worth the wait. Okay, but there is something that could have happened in the past um, that you are either healing from or need to heal from. Okay. Yeah. See, we got free yourself. See, a lot of you all may have children. Um, or a child, your focus is solely on them, okay? But the thing about this is find a balance and free yourself up. When your free time, you know, I keep telling you, I can't make this up. Look what keeps coming up. No love. You get into know somebody on a deeper level, okay? So when you get some free time, when you free your time up from children or work or whatever it is, free your time up. Free your time up and do something that you want to do. Be more open to um, new love coming in because the opportunity is definitely here. We got the moon that wanted to just jump out. Okay. Tell me more. See, yeah, nine of pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. So this is for the singles, okay? This is for the singles. Some of y'all are dealing with a water sign or a water sign um, could be, oh gosh, yeah. I'm getting that there is like some insecurities. Maybe you feel insecure. There's something here that you're holding on to that that you're crying over sp spilled milk about. Um, could be having major regrets, but I'm getting a little insecure. Yeah, you feel could be feeling insecure. Look at this. Look at that. I definitely do feel like it is time for you to go out and have some fun, okay? Now, when you do do this, this is going to allow you to build your confidence level. Um, we got the strength card here. We got the lovers here, which is you guys' energy. And then we got that six of wands as your outcome. A lot of attention, being recognized. The three of cups here is saying be social, Okay, get a social circle, um, go out, have some fun. But I feel like there is something that you don't feel confident about. And you're still holding on to it because the Five of Cups is your challenge. Okay, so tell me why the Five of Cups is here. Chariot. Something fell apart. Something fell apart here. It happened out of the blue. Um, maybe you've been keeping this in about how you truly feel. You you want to like purge. You some of you need to like purge because I feel like something that in the past happened. It was it happened too abruptly for you to grasp it. Um, it happened very abruptly, and I still feel like you could be either still holding on to that, still looking at a situation with regrets. Wow. 
why is that king of cups here what is this king of cups energy my hermit could be a virgo you feel lonely i feel like some of y'all feel alone why is this king of cups here and the hermit here I don't feel like this is a person per se. I feel like this is an energy. And I feel like some of y'all feel uh, like you're doing some soul searching, meditating, taking some time to yourself. Yeah, you're doing some introspection. Yeah. You're reflecting. We got mirror. You're reflecting. Yeah. I, I definitely see you taking like some time to yourself. Um, there's something that did not go right. I feel like this is past energy. Yeah, I feel like you needed some time. Like, I feel like you needed some time to yourself. I feel like it's time for you to come out of hermit mode, okay? I feel like some of you have been in, in hermit mode trying to heal, get over something that happened in the past, letting something go. I feel like you were giving this, giving yourself some space and some time. Let's see. We got the Page of Swords and the Three of Cups. That's a little bit of gossiping going on. That's a little bit of tea. Okay, so... You feel like, you know what, this is my time to get out a little bit, you know, sip some tea, sip some wine, sip some coffee, whatever, drink a beer or two with my friends. I feel like if that's what you need to do, I feel like it's time for you to come out. I feel like it's time for you to to be more social. I do see like like you guys have taken the time. Um, to meditate, think about things, and I, I just don't want y'all to stay in that energy um, for too long because what ends up happening is you get depressed or people start to worry or, you know, it's, it's, you need to come out and be more social, okay? Okay, you could be feeling like you don't have anybody to talk to. Um you can be feeling like you don't have anybody to talk to. That was confirmation. About, you feel like you don't have anyone to talk to about these, these issues. So you just been kind of like keeping it to yourself. I got a Leo energy here. Um... I have someone over here who could be tired of kind of like they want to know if you're going to accept some type of offer or not. This person over here could be a Leo. They, they're trying to figure out if you're going to accept some type of offer or not. The thing about this is they may know too much of your business. They feel like you should close this chapter. I see a heartbreak. I see some sorrow. Um, they're, they're saying that that relationship was old. So this could have something to do with, with the relationship. Um, they feel like you should be over it. Um, you got a decision. What are you going to do? Are you going to accept 
um, a new offer. You may already have a new offer on the table. They just they just want to know: Are you going to accept this new offer? Are you open to that? We got the lovers here in your hopes and fears. Yeah, the three of pentacles. You're not sure if this if this new situation is going to work. Some of y'all y'all have someone new already in mind. You're not sure if it's going to be worth it. Um, I do see that you want somebody that you can build with. You want somebody that is, you can build with. You don't want you don't want no play play mess. Now the outcome is the six of wands. This is success. Eight of swords. Yeah, like you're trying to avoid drama at all costs. You don't want any drama in your next connection. Okay, so you're like, skip, let's skip the drama. Let's skip the dramatics. Okay, um, I feel like you want something more stable and secure. And I'm going to be willing to bet you are willing to walk away uh, for things that no longer serve you. But I do see a new man. Okay, for the ones that are looking, Ace of Pentacles is a very solid offer. We got him right here, the Emperor. Okay, the Emperor. And for the the men who are watching, we got the Empress. Okay, now the thing about this is that's very beautiful is that they're right here next to each other. The Empress and the Emperor. Okay, a match made in heaven. This is a twin flame, a soulmate, somebody who is on your level. Okay, someone who is just as bossed up as you are okay power couple yep and you ain't got to worry about it this time you ain't gonna be disappointed disappointed okay you ain't got to worry about this toxic energy right here they might this person might not even drink or smoke okay yeah this person you i i can hear you saying it seems like they're pretty stable you hope so um, or things can go back to how it was when y'all was just in the talking phase. Okay, so some of y'all are very, very, um, you know, kind of like isolated. You have someone who is trying to pursue you. But I feel like some of y'all are kind of like still healing from something in your past. But a lot of you have someone who is prepared to give you something solid okay so that's the message that i got for you guys if this resonates with you be sure to hit the thumbs up share with your family and your friends and i'm gonna chat with y'all later